Hello, my name is Jean-Pierre Oudebe, and this is Ronnie, a uh, 12 years old uh, dressage horse. And here today we are helping him release some of his tension as part of his dressage training. When I first started with him, he had quite a compensation from the right hind to left front shoulder and into the neck. And this is now my third session with him, and he's a lot better. His uh, trainer had mentioned the improvement over the back, However, still is concerned of some of the tension he has in the base of the neck. And for that, I'm gonna address the lotus dorsi muscle that originate here and insert on the lower cervical. <clears throat> for that, I use some frictions and you see how he release and here you go. Very nice, very nice. So later on, I will pick up the leg and finalize some stretches. And now that I release that base of neck, I'm gonna address the upper neck and the top of the wither because they work as a triangle to assist. Now, if you're interested in learning some massage to help your horse, you can visit my website at Animal Massage Awareness, or you can pick up my book, Equine Massage, A Practical Guide, uh, it's published in several languages, so you might find it in your language of choice. So, <clears throat> here is a good important point. This is very important psychologically for the horse, because this is a meeting point of the top line in fascia and the low line. They both come to attach on the skull by this level, and you can see where this animal loves it because he's always releasing some tension from his training. Now his training is improving, so that's why he feels all that need to be worked. Now I'm going down the neck. So here I'm working on the brachiocephalicus, but I also want to release the sterno and homohyoid that are also very important muscle as they give a sense of balance to the animal and one of them attached on the sternum and one on the scapula. There you go. There you go. As you can see, as I'm working the expression of the horse, this is his main area of concern. The rest works beautiful. I'm addressing the upper cervical axis, and the shoulder axis, and the hind axis that really contribute to the balance of the horse. That's your left and right sides on each time. He has no problem doing this. <clears throat> Here you go. Very good. This is good. And this is also very good. Oh, yep. This is him releasing his tension. Here you go. And one more of that. Very good. All right. And if you have any questions, you can always reach me out through my website. And uh, I'd be glad to help you.